you guys had your first practice this morning. Just kind of talk about what you worked on and, uh, you know, kind of just uh, getting getting into everything, getting into the swing of things again. Um, first off, we did our running test and jumping test. And then early or later on in the morning, we did a lot of low-impact stuff so that we can kind of amp it up in the afternoon. Uh, we did a lot of – we did some run-throughs, defensive stuff, and then we did three-on-three, three, um, back row attacks, and basically a lot of low-impact, non-jumping – um, defensive stuff. Talk about uh, what you guys have done in the summer. Uh, obviously, 13 of the 14 players in this roster were here pretty much a month before the season started. Uh, what did you guys work on, kind of with some of the players who are new to the program, and how does that help uh, have you guys be further along when you start today? Um, one th really special thing about our program is that a lot of people are here in the summer, and we can really incorporate the newer players um, in all of our workouts, whether it be lifting, running, or practices, and this year, this summer, we had two captain's practices and um, for two hours, and we just kind of got the girls in. We ran through some of the drills that we do in practice that we knew we were, we were going to do, and then we just played six-on-six six as much as we could to kind of get that feel for each other and kind of build that chemistry. You obviously emerged, uh, even throughout your time as a sophomore, but really last year as a leader in this program. Uh, talk about what you kind of learned from last year and how you even incorporate that a little bit more uh, in your senior season, uh, you know, with you and Haley kind of playing your last season with the program and trying to build off last year's Final Four. Um, being a leader isn't easy. Uh, you definitely find yourself kind of alone a lot, and um, I have felt alone and kind of I'm trying to – make sure that I know how to handle each each person because everybody's different and some something might work for somebody and it might totally not work for the other person. And So I think that's been my biggest challenge is trying to see what works for each individual person um, but then bringing everybody together in a common way. And um, I think that was a really big thing for us last season. Talk about uh, the process for you guys, um, obviously, from the moment the Final Four ended last year, and you guys knew this would be your senior season. And historically, uh, Mike's teams have repeated usually in their Final Four appearances. Talk about kind of the end of last year and just uh, how you guys have built up uh, until now uh, during that point. Um, last year was super exciting, and it was, it was such a relief to make our goal of getting to the Final Four. But it left us hungry. I think we're hungry for more. We know we can play better than we did, and... Um, this season is kind of our chance to really make it all the way, get to the national championship, and um, I just think that everybody kind of has that fire burning inside them to really, really push for it this year, and hopefully that's going to take us all the way. It's kind of interesting from a Minnesota standpoint, um, kind of a culmination, especially of your guys' uh, club program, Northern Lights, where you, know, you have you and Haley, but now you have Tori Dixon and Ashley Whitman coming in. How cool is that to kind of just see the growth of uh, – just, you know, players that you play with throughout the course of uh, your career and you've seen grow up under you uh, in lower age groups. Talk about how exciting it is to kind of have all of you or a lot of you together here in this program. It's really cool. It's it's cool to see people evolve. Like, I remember watching Tori when she was, oh, like in, on the 14s team and Ashley. And it's just cool to kind of see, oh, my gosh, one day we could be teammates. And, and that really happened. And I'm just, I'm so excited because they are two really great players and, um, it's kind of fun to have that commonality between us that we played for the same club and we kind of have that, that pride between our, ourselves. And what do you guys talk about? Uh, you guys start practice, uh, you started practice this morning, but uh, what do you kind of build to knowing that, you know, the regular season uh, starts in about two and a half weeks or so? Uh, what are some of the things that you start off doing and then uh, kind of ramp up to as you go further in the uh, practice season? Um, first of all, I think chemistry is really important. We need to know how everybody plays and who plays the best with like what other person, and that's going to be really key, key to us because we have a lot of new people and we have such depth on our team that we kind of don't know who's going to play in this position, so there's competition everywhere. And so um, that's definitely going to be key and focusing on technique and kind of instilling our, our program and our basic structure of our, of our team for everybody and kind of getting all on the same page. I guess finally, um, you guys, I, we talked about it earlier that you guys got a chance to practice with some of the new players, and uh, you, know, you add four new players to this program. Uh, you bring a, a back a returning core of nine players from last year's Final Four run. Just talk about what you guys kind of were able to work on uh, during the summer and what you saw out of some of the new players. Um, I think, like I said again, the chemistry thing, working on that, working on and off the court. We did a lot of team bonding activities, and um, we went up to Harms' cabin, and kind of just relaxed and hung out. But I, I really think that translates onto the court because um, 
you're going to be with each other all year round, and it's really good to get a good core base with someone else off the court as well. And so we really worked hard on that, and um, just connecting with our setters and um, defensively our, our placement on the court I think is, was key too.